I'm Tom from Do-It-Yourself Home Automation, and this is a look at my Micro Mini Kickboard Scooter. So this is a Swiss-made scooter. The uh, quality is really excellent. We've got a metal column here, and then um, good high-quality plastic at the bottom. And um, it's got a kind of rubberized grip for your kid to stand on this. And this scooter actually uh, adapts. This is the scooter design, but it also comes with a seat that you can have come out of here. Uh, my son is a little bit too old to sit on that at this point, um, but that goes up to, I believe, 44 pounds. And then beyond that, this will actually go up to 75 pounds. So it's for your toddler, um, preschooler, you know, all the way up to probably a, uh, a five or six year old, maybe even a little bit bigger. Um, you can adjust the height of the steering column here, depending on the size of your kid. So you just unlock this, easily slides up and down um, to adjust the height. You just unlock the little lock in the front. And then here we go, we can adjust all the way down from very short, if you've got a tiny kid, all the way up to big kid height here as they get bigger. Um, just lock it off with this and you're good to go. Um, good high quality bearings on here. The wheels themselves almost look like uh, roller skate wheels. They're a little bit bigger, so you've got a little bit more traction there. And it is kind of a tricycle design. So you've got two wheels in the front and one in the back. Um, that's really excellent for stability. So you can see it stands up on its own. It's really helpful for a little kid. And it provides them good stability as they're starting to learn to use this because they don't really have to balance that much. Um, another nice feature here is that uh, they can turn by leaning. So you can see if I push this to the side, it actually pivots those wheels. So they can do quite, um, you know, uh, tight corners once they get the hang of this. And you've also got a brake on the back. This is a friction brake on the wheel. So when they push down on this it, uh, with their back foot, it hits the wheel and stops the scooter. Um, so really helpful to have that because they're not wearing their shoes out, dragging them on the ground, Fred Flintstone style, to break. Um, it's got some reflective tape on the back here. I still wouldn't necessarily ride it at night. Um, I think it works great on flat surfaces like uh, at a park. And um, just a reminder, always make sure that your kid's wearing a helmet when they're using this, even though it's low to the ground, just for safety's sake, it's important to do that. Um, nice grippy handlebars, easy for them to hold on to here. And uh, we've got these little kind of playful things at the end that are rubberized. Um, all of it's really high quality. My son's been using this for, I think about two years now. And uh, you know, it still has hold up really well to lots of crashes and falling over and being thrown in the back of the minivan and that kind of thing. Um, just really excellent quality overall with the micro mini kick, kickstand here, um, uh, kickboard. So there's, uh, again, that seat you can start out uh, when they're a little bit younger, but I uh, just leapt right into having him start with it as a full scooter here. And uh, I think it's been a really great product for that use.